Hello, check. Monsieur. Copycats Club is a platform for all women that wakeboard. It's completely changing the, the narrative, really. We started off not really being fully represented, and now we have a place to be represented exactly how we want it to be. Go it's gang. <laughs> yeah, like, it's always hard to describe, um, but I would say it's kind of a movement. It's like just getting together, because also I get asked, like, are you like part of the team or something? I'm like, no, nah, there is no team. It's not about a team. It's just about everyone shredding together and like supporting each other, not like having these, these negative vibes. Actually, it started like Katinka and me, like first time in Valdosta. It was like first time, like just girls making a trip it was kind of cool. We say like, we want to play skate and then we like just talking and giggling, bullshitting around the lake and say like, we're not playing skate, you know what I mean? And and we like rode behind each other and the, what, the first one did always the trick and the other one was like, like we copying and then just bullshit and it came like copy, copycats and then club because we're all the girls right now out there. So I was like, then I like started more like doing more than the Instagram page was like, Copycats Club. I mean, like, I don't know if I like that name. It's like, I need to stack my wolf in it. When everyone is so hyped on it, I was like, mm, okay, we're doing it. I guess, yeah, it, it Slingshot did release the, the a pro model for Sina, but that's just a way of Slingshot to help out Sina. It doesn't mean that it's just just Slingshot. When I think of Copycats Club, I just see it as a collective. I don't see it as like, oh, this is a sister brand of a specific board brand. I, it's so open and welcoming to everybody, I mean. Yeah, people ride the board for sure, they love the board. But it's not all about the board and no, bindings no, and no, stuff. No. It's more about getting together and yeah, from that, Sina had the opportunity to design a board. Actually, I just got the call from Jeff. And he asked, what you think about that? And I'm like, ooh, yeah, for sure, I like that. You know what I mean? Everyone wants their own board. I was straight thinking about, because I want that like Copycats Club is for everyone and not just like Slingshot. And like feel a lot of people like think it's just Slingshot. It's like, no, it's not, you know? And then seeing Jamie Lopina wrapping a Copycats Club sticker on the board makes like, yes, that's what we need. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't was that time such a sick rider right now and I still want to be a sick rider and keep progress and I'm so stuck yeah. having in and I'm getting even better. But what in this time I was like, so you're not riding that thing, why is she getting a board? But it's like, it's just not my riding, you know, like everything around what I'm doing. I'm like, stop being jealous, you know what I mean? Like, let, like I'm fucking working every day so much for that shit, like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now the fourth magazine is dropping soon. I mean, should drop already soon, but... Theme is hustle making his own company. It's crazy. Like, there's just like stuff going on now. The print company not shipping the magazine out and hopefully have this time this winter and make some new loving line. Yeah, she's got a full plate. I mean, just being around her, she has to like lock herself in her office and just not talk to anyone. And, um... She's doing everything, you know, social media, the whole design aspect of it, um, reaching out to sponsors, creating every single page by hand. She sits there and draws it out. She does it all Actually, yes. and she's killing I mean, it. <laughs> I mean, behind all the fun weekends and events and shredding together and having a yeah, real nice print magazine, there's a lot of work behind and that pretty much does, you know, on her, on her own. Her being so open and, and caring, I guess, of all the other women, no matter if they're pros or not pros, I think that kind of loving aspect that she brought, I think brought all of us together. I mean, we've got some, some fun ideas. We want to get more into winching, get more into filming, you know, just get, get more out there, do more work. Yeah, they should also see that we all should ride more together and push each other 
and then we can, can grow even bigger. Because like, no one is doing the loan stuff. Like, no, no single person makes a million. They always, they saw like all the little thing what is behind it. And I'm so thankful for everyone who helps me. Like, without Wes, I wouldn't do that what I'm doing. Trust their fun. I mean, that's why I, why I start Copycats Club. Because people should, I mean, that's why we do this sport, because Everything is about in life to have fun a little bit and laugh and enjoy, have passion and sometimes people forget it when they do stuff alone. So keep making friends, have fun.